Sometimes our scatter plots make nice lines, right? This one doesn't make a line. There's no line that goes through it, right? Um, but oftentimes we might have a bunch of points that make a line. So here's one where the line's already been given to us. We call this a linear relationship. It makes a line. Um, and we can use this to kind of make some predictions or estimates. So we have the balance in an account. That's right here, the dollars or B for balance. Um, and then it's a student's checking account so many months after they opened it. So T months. Um, and it looks like they're, it's declining, right? Which means they're losing money or spending money, right? Since it's going down. So they're probably spending money but not putting any money in. Just so we can kind of get used to what these patterns mean. And so let's see how we make predictions. So we want to find the balance in the account three months after the student opened the account. So since I know months, I'm going to go to the months column, the months part of the graph. I'm going to go to three. Um, if I had a ruler, I would use a ruler to go up. And then I'd use a ruler to go over. So I went up until I hit the line. And then I went over to balance, and it looks like the balance is 1,500. So I would describe this point as 3, 1,500. The horizontal number always comes first. So that means we have three months. I'm telling you more than the question asks. So three months and $1,500. That's an ordered pair or a point on the graph. So we're basically just doing the opposite of what we did above. So after three months, there's $1,500. Um, and then let's do one more. Now, um, we know the balance is 500, but we want to know when. So since we know the balance, I'm going to go to the vertical one. I'm going to go to 500. I'm going to go over till I hit the line, go down to months, and it looks like we get five months. So after five months, there's only $500. And again, if you wanted to write that as a point, the horizontal always comes first, so it's five comma 500. So horizontal, like horizon, so it's flat, and then vertical goes up and down. So this is how we would read a scattergram or a line if we already had the graph.